What's up, YouTube? We're out here at Black Canyon Lake in northern Arizona. This is my camp. Forest fire came through here a few years ago, so it's kind of wiped out. It's a lot of new growth, small pine saplings and stuff. Tons of uh, wood laying around, dead wood laying around. Pine cones everywhere. And that was the fire pit I had last night. And it's so windy today that we decided to go with a Dakota fire pit. And basically just dug a hole in the ground. Kind of like a trench, kind of oval shaped. And then piled a bunch of rocks around the edges, filled that with dirt just to build it up even higher so the hole is more accentuated. I realize it's really windy so you may not be able to hear this very well. And instead of trying to dig two separate holes and making the dirt tunnel, I just put two uh, small rocks in the, on the sides at the bottom and laid a huge rock on top so that it kind of forms a tunnel just with the rocks and then obviously on that other side it's empty and then I'm just burning pine cones over here they seem to burn really slow and I'm gonna be cooking on this in a little bit so I'll probably just keep piling pine cones in maybe a few small pieces of wood and do it that way and my camps uh, Pretty simple, just kind of gypsy camping a little bit. Just got stuff laid out on the ground and hanging from trees. Got the hammock set up. Uh, my Ozark Trail tent. Pretty big, it's like 14 by eight. And then I just kind of cut off the, the limbs on what I call the resource tree. That's where I hang all my gear, keep all my gear. This is kind of cool. This is how we dug the Dakota pit. I found this antler piece just laying in the woods and used that to dig out around some of those rocks. Got this plastic trowel which helped scoop out the dirt. And then my uh, SOG hatchet hand axe. That kind of helped me get in there and knock some of those hard rocks loose. There's the hammock. I use these golf club grips to help protect the tree and preserve the rope from fraying. There's a small stand of uh, pine saplings over there. There are a few other campers scattered around, and we use that whole area for, you know, personal stuff, bathing, and using the restroom. And it just kind of acts as a natural barrier so nobody can see you in there. Because otherwise, it's pretty wide open. If you look out here, that's really wide open. All those trees fell down, burned down. So, not a whole lot going on around here. Not much in the, as far as game. I do have my pellet gun right there. Crossman 2240. Been shooting that a little bit. Just have one chair and a hammock in the tent fire pit's still going so I'm gonna stoke that up a little bit and start brunch here in a minute and there's my campsite thanks for watching guys make sure to like comment and subscribe take care